why the hell so many people are trying to tell me to slow down. Seems like motherfuckers should be shutting the hell up and enjoying the show. Hey, Winos, how's it going? I see y'all in the chat. Now, listen, listen, listen. Tonight's show is going to be a little different. Hold on. <coughs> it's going to be a little different, okay, because... I am under the weather, okay? My allergies have completely taken over. I'm on day eight. My nose feels like I just want to pull it off. You know, I got a sinus drip. I'm just, you know, all day. And you'll hear it in this interview, okay? And so since I'm not able to perform tonight because I kind of get out of breath and stuff and I can't drink because I'm on my allergy meds, this is live right now, okay? But the interview that you're going to see following this is not live, okay? Let me see what y'all are talking about in the comments, all right? So hold on. I know this is a little different, um, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, I know this is a little different. So, um, please bear with me, okay? We will try to return next week. I didn't even know my lipstick was off. This is so crazy, okay? I love you guys. We're going to go ahead and start this interview that I recorded earlier today. You're going to hear the congestion. I'm so sorry, okay, because I did not want to, like, leave you guys without anything on Fuckery Friday. So we're going to try to drop something on days that I am unable to perform. Look, I, it's hard for me to even raise my voice. That's how congested I am, okay? So um, I hope you enjoy it. It reminds me, this interview, okay, involving T-Pain's mistress, it reminds me, if you are a day one, of that interview with uh, uh, Waka Flocka's, um, I guess, side chick, LaBam, it's the same, th it's like, it has the same vibe, okay? It's really funny. It's kind of emotional, okay? This is her story about being with T-Pain for, you know, a couple years or whatever. And it's interesting, okay? It's interesting, all right? So um, I will be in the comments talking with you all. Jesus, it's so hard, okay? I will be in the comments, um, you know, engaging with y'all, and I will come back after the video is over. You guys can ask, will we, will, I can't answer no questions because I can barely talk right now. So... Okay, but I'll be in the comments, okay? So we're going to go ahead and start this interview. I love you guys, and I will definitely see you next Friday for a full-fledged fuckery Friday, okay? I can't drink tonight because I'm on allergy meds, all right? All right, uh, let's go ahead and get started. Passion. Hey. How you doing? Hey, Tasha. Turn your volume up just a little bit. I need everybody to hear you now. I really appreciate you, um giving me this time out to speak. Oh, you've been crying it, today. I did. I called you and told you, like, it was, this shit been really hard for me. Like, this was 2018 going into 2019. Like, okay. so I really appreciate you. You know, it took me a long time to um, speak out or whatever. So. Hard for me. Okay, listen, we're not going to make it difficult. You got you some shots, <laughs> right? And some hookah, Correct. Can I, where's your wine? Girl, listen, I'm on this allergy medication, child. If I take this oh. wine right now, my ass would be laid out, okay? Okay. Yeah, so but some somebody here got to be clear-headed. You understand what I'm saying? So, like, <laughs> yes, like, my allergies have been change of season, candles, all the above. But anyway, um, this is about you right now. You look very beautiful, okay? Thank you. That is a true makeup and uh, hair and stuff is on fleek. Um, you're out of L.A., and LA, yes. okay, you have been going back and forth with T Pain. Yes. Now he's usually pretty low key. Okay, we don't usually hear anything from him. I mean, I think the last time we heard anything from him is when he said he blew through all of his money. Um. Yeah, he told me that too. That you know, when I got pregnant, he was like, "We don't need another bill. I just had to pay two hundred fifty thousand dollars for my brother." But okay. So, okay, yeah, yeah, okay, wait a minute. All right, so he's married, of course. And from, I don't want people to think of me as a, a Selena Powell type of sad asshole. Um, from from what I know, yeah, I've laid with you and you, you, I've, you've spoken to your wife. Oh. So, that, yeah, so that you have a open relationship. I mean, does he and really have an open together? Does he really have an open relationship, or is that something that he well, just told that's you? Just, that's just 
something he told me, you know? Because like, I, I personally think it would make anyone sleeping with a married man feel comfortable. Some women care. I would never sleep with a married man if they didn't have a relationship. And I'm a freak. Oh, you okay? All right, so the liquor's no, working. Voice. The liquor is working, okay, and the hookah. All right. <laughs> no, Tasha, I'm just speaking the truth, and like it took me a long time to speak my truth. Like, how did y'all meet? Let's start from the beginning. How did you meet T Pain? I met T Pain through Andy. I used to work for a guy named Dito. Dito's indicted right now. For what? What he do, Joe? Right, your bitches. Oh, wow. That's different. That, okay. Well, listen, I'm going to need you I, to come back and spill some wine on that. Okay. He, I don't know if it's true, but when I worked for him, I didn't see it. So, um, however, that I met him through Andy. Andy said, paying something a little gathering, whatever, whatever at the SLS. Okay. So, um, he was on me. He was on you? The regular. Like, what do you mean? Like, so you're you're at a party, and he just no, we, not a party, but it was like a gathering. Okay, and so he didn't. So I took a porn star girl there that he used to fuck around with, and he was like over her. So, um, we like you know connected. Okay, what did the porn star ex girlfriend have to say about you and her oh, ex T Pain, who happens to be married, connected? Me and her a lot because me and him start fucking around. Oh, did y'all like fight or anything? Or you just no, kind of just stop talking? No, it's just, it's, ugh, goodbye. You know, it's like a wham bam, thank you man with them or whatever, you know? So it's like regular. Okay. As far as me and him went. Okay, so he has a pretty repetitive behavior when it comes to stepping outside of his marriage. Always. Okay. Um. Well, so you're at a party. You start Not you a meet, party. Okay, a it's gathering. Like, like okay. A, like a hotel, like... A hotel little soiree. Okay, so you're at a gathering, and um, did I you guys strike like, up conversation? Yeah, like me, like I'm just like funny, I'll go on, like I'm chill, like I don't be pressed, like I've been around mass celebrities. Okay. Like, I'm not pressed. Okay. You know what I mean? So um, we just connected. Okay, and did you did you go home with him that night, or did y'all just exchange numbers? We, we fucked around that night. Oh wow! Okay, all right. Yeah, um, that's okay, girl. I mean, back in my day, who child? Huh? It went from there. Okay, so this is the beginning of 2018. Um, the middle. Okay. Are you sad again? You still love him, don't you? Okay. Yeah. Tasha, you know, I've been talking to you about this shit all day. This shit is bothering me. Okay. And I don't want to, like, put him on blast or anything, but it's just like, you left me while I was pregnant. You know? Okay, let's, okay, let's fast forward. Like, okay, so yeah. you're dating... You're sleeping with each other. Are you are you guys traveling together? Huh? They're telling me you love me and it's just been really hard for my dating life. Like and you 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 strapped that away from me, like wanted to have a baby. I'm thirty two, you know? Oh wow, I thought you were younger than that. No, I'm thirty two. You look like a baby. Thank you, Christy. Oh, thank you. I need something to my damn allergies and shit. I'm trying to make you laugh here, okay? No, come here, please. It's my sister. She oh, hi, sister. How you doing? No, sister, how do you? Come here. Oh, okay. <laughs> this is my sister. Oh, hi, sister. Oh, she's a baby. My sister's in there getting makeup done. Okay, okay. Asha. I'm glad they're there to kind of help you to get yourself together. Okay, so. Uh, because, I mean, this happened in 2018, 2019, because I don't want to seem like no bitch that's like, oh, trying to expose somebody like this shit. Be, Tasha, I told you, like, this shit really been hard on me. Okay. This shit has really been hard on me. Okay, let's no, you strap you strap taking a kid away from me, you know. So, so, okay, let's get to the pregnancy. How far in did you get pregnant? See, I enjoy oral sex, but to be honest, some of my experiences have been not pleasing due to lack of proper vaginal hygiene. I went down on this shit once, 
and the yoni was so good and fresh, it took me on like a whole nother level of just pleasure. So at that moment, I had to stop and ask, what are you using? And she told me, embrace Pangea Feminine Wash. We all know that a fresh yoni brings on a whole new level of confidence. So visit EmbracePangea.com. And of course, I got my winos covered for a discount. So use the coupon code Tasha K for 10% off your first order. AdamandEve.com. I'm talking toys, bondage, lingerie, and so much more. Plus, they have 24-7 customer service. So you can order at 3 a.m. if you ain't coming, if you get me, okay? And if something isn't working out, you can send it back within 90 days. No hassle. And if that's not enough, you can also take pleasure in knowing that 20% of their profits goes to help fight the spread of HIV around the world. So go on ahead and log on to adamandeve.com. Use the code Tasha K for 50% off one item plus free shipping in the U.S. and Canada. Some exclusions apply now, but hurry up and visit adamandeve.com so they can make you come. The olive leaf extract can reverse high blood pressure and diabetic high blood sugar or the sugar, as some of our grandmamas may call it. It can also kill any nasty little bugs in your bodies like parasites, bacteria, fungi, tumors, and much, much more. And if that's not enough, you can also tell certain cancers like breast, prostate, colon, liver, and skin cancer to take a seat because the olive leaf extract has been known to fight it. And their friend lupus can get it too. So visit myoliveleaf.biz to help get your health in order. I've been told that finding your perfect match is almost impossible. Almost. Well, guess what, baby? No more swiping left. Because whether you want something big, something small, something new, or you just feel like dumping your old one. Miss Didi of Imperial South Co. is a licensed Georgia real estate agent who is here to help you to find your dream home or to help you get rid of that old one. No matter if you're a first-time buyer or empty nester looking to downsize, she can help you with all your buying and selling needs. Check out Miss Dee Dee by visiting her website at www.imperialsouthco.com. No one is gonna work harder to get you better results. I got abortion at three months. Three months, oh, that's pretty far in. And then he tried to fly me to Utah to get me drunk. You know, and uh, I did. You got drunk while you were pregnant? Yeah. Why? why? And if you see on my page, you'll see, like, I was in Utah, I did complex call with him and all that. Like, whatever, like. I'm over this shit, bro. Aww. <laughs> No, okay, hold on, hold on. Okay, take your time, take your time. Like, I don't want to expose it, but I don't want to, like, do too much, you know? Because you, like, I told you, like, I'm not that type of person. Like, it's okay, this is not exposing. This shit is fucked up, like, because it's a lot of women going through this shit, not just celebrities, like, rich niggas. Like, he gave me a whole bacteria infection. I've never had a fucking disease a day in my life. Okay. I put you in the shower. What? What, what do you mean? You're about to keep fucking me. You're going to wash your ass. Okay. Um. So... All right. So let's, let's talk about... Let's talk about the baby. Okay? Um. So you tell him you're pregnant. How far into the relationship... I told him like mid January, so I'm about to drop this clip of 2019. Yes, but I'm about to drop this clip. Okay, hold on before you drop the clip. Hold on, because I'm, I'm gonna add it to the interview. Okay, because so you I don't you can email it to I'm me. A fucking liar! You're not a liar. Nobody's calling you a liar. Okay, nobody's calling you a liar. I know you're emotional right now. He knows, like he knows. That so, shit is like killing me. <laughs> Is this a is this is this a plea? Do you kind of want him to kind of see this interview? And I don't give a damn if you see it or not. It's just like damn, this shit been bothering me for so long. Lowe's, his whole team, his little fucking assistant, and then his camera girl that his wife hates that he know that it's, I fucking about to slap dog shit out of her. Oh, okay. Me, and her got into in the hotel room. 
Because he told me that she was at his house and his wife. Like, it was just, like, crazy, Tasha. Now, okay, now, had you ever met his wife? No. Okay, so y'all never had words or anything? No, no. No? Okay. No, me, and, me and Pam Pam never had words. Pam Pam? Child. <laughs> now he called that bitch Pam Pam. I said, what? Pam Pam. I, I, now he's heard, been with her since high school, right? I don't have nothing against her because she's a wife. Okay. But when I seen her, I was like, sure, got a baby fat jacket on in the club. Oh, it's too, oh. It's too hot for that. The shade. Okay. <laughs> she coming for the wife. Okay. Uh, coming for her, just like when I see her in the club, I was like, huh? It's a baby fat jacket. I mean, I think Kimora Lee relaunched Baby Fat. Was it an updated baby? Baby Fat is lit. Okay. I used to wear Baby Fat. Okay. Um, yeah, I think him and his wife have been together since high school. So They've been together forever. Okay. I'm laying in the bed with that man and he talked to his wife. So I'm thinking like, it's open. We 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 um, always stay at the SLS and she knows he stays there. And then at the went, SLS, what's that? SLS Hotel Beverly Hills. Okay. And um, we, because I don't want people to think I'm a fucking like crazy bitch because I'm not tweaking like. Not it's okay. Crazy. A lot of women are crazy. It's okay. Because I know I'm not, but I'm I'm okay. real though, and I like I really have to get this shit off my chest. Like, okay, we're at the SLS. Okay. And um. We used to go to Bazaar. Bazaar was like a fucking bar downstairs. Nick, you all up on me. Get off me. Well, why you wanted him to get off you? Because you have a wife and then we don't want this shit to be nowhere. That people knew. Tasha, before you. Okay. I've had blogs and people to... People. Okay. Like, I swear to God. And I did not put him out there, but I'm like, man, you really don't give a fuck about me. Okay. I got pregnant. You really didn't give a fuck about me. Oh, I love you, babe. Oh, you cheating on me. All right. Okay. All right. Um, how many shots have you had so far? I've had three. Okay. What you what you drinking? What you shooting? Casamigos. Oh, I've never heard tequila. I, I take it tequila make you want to fight a bitch or something. No, tequila. I would slap a bitch down her. Okay, <laughs> I kind of figured that. All right, so I'm not really, I'm not upset or anything, and I'm not drunk. I'm just. No, I'm not saying you're drunk, but you know, alcohol it can, you know, it can loosen us up a little. I'm bit. telling the truth. Okay, like, okay, and listen, listen. If you weren't telling the truth, you wouldn't be on this platform. Okay, so I'm telling the truth, and he knows when he sees this shit because he's gonna see it. Okay, pain, pain knows. That I'm not lying. Okay. All right. So you're pregnant and, you know, you tell him. What What was his reaction? I'd be quiet. What was his reaction? Oh. I'm oh. Sure okay. Yeah, I'm going to give you the reaction. This okay. Way. Okay. Two seconds. Because I ain't going to, you know, I ain't, giving, I ain't giving it up like that. But. I hate it. It's it's hard for me to kind of hear it, so don't worry about it. I'm gonna show you. I. It sounds like you got a a, a pretty lengthy recording. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, you know everybody. The whole blog's about the bill, right? Because I didn't want. Yeah, I have to because I'm a part of it. Hello. What? So I get it. Because I didn't want you to stress like. Yeah, I have to. Yeah, I have to because I'm a part of it. Hello. Bye. Sasha, I'm not lying. Look, Sasha. Hi, T Pain. How are you, sweetie? Like, goodbye. Yeah. Yeah. Goodbye. 
And it's way longer than that. But what? Let me ask you something. Like, because it sounds like you still love him and you still kind of want to be with him. I don't want to be with him no more. I like he manipulates you into thinking that he loves, like you. He loves you, and you're like the most beautiful girl in the world. Like, and it's okay. Like the women that go through that, not just celebrities, but like rich people and people in, in, in better places. Like you know, and I'm not that type of person that put a person out there, but like I'm just really over it. Okay, you strap. Like, you knew that I wanted a kid, so you're not in my pussy. Okay. And you stepped that away from me. Well, what made you have the abortion if you didn't want to have it? Because I didn't want to be a single mother. Oh, he told you you were going to be a single mom? Like, he literally said that. Like, you're going to be a single mom if you keep... Like, it's going to be everywhere, and it's going to be this, and it's going to be that. I'm like... I grew up around that shit, Tasha. Like, I can't... Um, I mean, I guess not to say because I mean I'm I'm pro choice. Whatever you choose, a woman You're has a wife. My best friend Hazel E is a wife. You're a wife. Like I'm not that type of girl. Like you made it seem to me like you 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 and your wife have this sober relationship. I don't fuck with married men, bro. I don't do that. Okay. I would never come on to your husband. I would never come on to my best friend's husband. Okay. I would never come on to nobody's husband. You came up to me. You made it seem like, and I felt for you like an idiot. Did you? Were you okay with being in a poly, a polygamous relationship? Yeah, you were okay with. Th- I'm a freak. Oh, okay, okay. I didn't know. Like, I mean, there's plenty of women that are freaks now. Like, you know, they may not be okay I'm a little, with that. I'm a little freak a little bit. Okay. I'm a, little, I'm a freak a little bit. Okay. All right. Uh, um. Honestly. So you you did he go with you to have the abortion? No. Okay. Did he send you the money for the abortion? He sent me some money, but it wasn't for it wasn't for the abortion. I have fucking good um <laughs> good what? I, I have good uh, medic not medical, but like good insurance. Okay. Okay. So the ins- oh insurance paid for abortion? I didn't know that. Yeah, my insurance paid for it for sure. Okay, cool. Now, after you had the abortion, what happened? He disappeared. Okay. What, what do they all do, Sasha? They disappeared. Now, you guys haven't spoken since you had the abortion. We haven't spoken since. And then um, after I, I got the abortion or whatever, I seen him in the club, Ace of Diamonds, and that's when he was with Amber. Amber who? His wife. Okay. That's when she had on the baby fat jacket? It was a baby fat for me. Okay. So she was, she had the baby fat jacket on. I'm looking like cute. So my friend went to the lounge and went to. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I was with Hazel E that night. We we blew like 10 bands in the spot. Right? Oh, okay. Let me hold uh, something. I need 10 bands. Yeah. So um, it was a baby fat. And then. Um, <laughs> They went to a hookah lounge, which my, I have three best friends, Jessica. Okay. Chrissy. Okay. Well, four, sorry. Chrissy, J- Jessica, Hazel, and Tasha. Hi, Tasha. Uh, you talking about me? Yeah. No, I know. You're talking about you. <laughs> I know. She, I know. You. I'm better. Um, okay. Uh, my other friend, Tasha, went because Los, his security, we always contact through Los. Okay. So, um, so you would call him on his security's phone to get to him because he don't want me to call. You know what's up? Like, uh, wait, but I thought y'all was in an open relationship, though. Baby, I got the number. You want to talk on WhatsApp? Oh, okay. You want to talk on WhatsApp? We're out there because WhatsApp, you know, I don't think it's traceable. So <laughs> that's corny. So you don't think his wife knew about you at all? Uh Amber, it sounds like she didn't. I don't know if Amber knew about me, but Amber knew that passion was Andy's friend. Okay. You know I mean? Yeah. But I mean, it's Andy, different. Like Andy used to work for details. So like, and Tasha, my other sister, I did my hair. Um, passion was Andy's friend. Right, Tasha? Okay. I thought. Okay. So. Girl. 
So what what do you I mean, what if his wife sees this? Baby, I fucked your nigga. Okay. Your nigga got me pregnant and he needs to step into the plate. And then what really pissed me off, stop telling your nigga, tell your nigga, stop telling people he love people. Okay. That's it. That's it. Then you want to, I laid in the bed and talk to your man. Like I laid in the bed while your man was talking to you. I don't like that shit. So I'm thinking that you guys have an open relationship, but come to find out, <gasps> every kid knows. <laughs> okay so you really don't care at all about like you know putting his wife on blast or anything I don't. okay he didn't care now let's talk about because you said he he gave you, you an infection in you're not in my pussy you didn't care <laughs> now you said he gave you an infection he gave me a bacteria infection okay what, what? And i'm not ashamed of that like i've never had a disease a day in my life okay it's okay women get you know when we get I infections. Call Hazel. I call Hazel. And what Hazel tell you? You know Hazel E. Yes. That's my best friend. I call her like bitch. But like my fucking pussy finna fall out. Oh wow. <laughs> oh wow. What'd she tell you? And she was on the phone with me while I was in the bed with him. So period. Okay. So you're what what did I Hazel to tell doctor, you? My doctor told me that I had a UTI and he was only I was fucking for a minute. Well, you know, with the UTI, I, I wouldn't call that like a an infection. That's that's pretty much it, bad it because bad. what happens is it's like bacteria just gets into the urethra, I believe, and causes an infection. Like Tasha, that's just so nasty. But I mean that that comes from like anyone can get that. Like if you don't use the bathroom or like bitch, my coochie was like hot. Yeah, I mean that happens when you get a UTI. Like, but if you don't, like, it's that's why they tell women to like not to say that you did not do it, but like, you know, pee after you're done, you know, having sex and Baby, wash. Got in the shower, like every time after I fuck, I get the shower. Okay, okay. So, but he didn't want to, and I had to argue. Cause like, you, I gotta argue and fight you to get the shower. <laughs> like what? <laughs> AdamandEve.com. I'm talking toys, bondage, lingerie, and so much more. Plus, they have 24-7 customer service, so you can order at 3 a.m. if you ain't coming, if you get me, okay? And if something isn't working out, you can send it back within 90 days, no hassle. And if that's not enough, you can also take pleasure in knowing that 20% of their profits goes to help fight the spread of HIV around the world. So go on ahead and log on to AdamandEve.com. Use the code Tasha. Okay, for 50% off one item plus free shipping in the U.S. and Canada. Some exclusions apply now, but hurry up and visit adamandeve.com so they can make you come. The olive leaf extract can reverse high blood pressure and diabetic high blood sugar, or the sugar, as some of our grandmamas may call it. It can also kill any nasty little bugs in your bodies like parasites, bacteria, fungi, tumors, and much, much more. And if that's not enough, you can also tell certain cancers like breast, prostate, colon, liver, and skin cancer to take a seat because the olive leaf extract has been known to fight it. And their friend lupus can get it too. So visit myoliveleaf.biz to help get your health in order. I've been told that finding your perfect match is almost impossible. Almost. Well, guess what, baby? No more swiping left. Because whether you want something big, something small, something new, or you just feel like dumping your old one. Miss Dee Dee of Imperial South Co. is a licensed Georgia real estate agent who is here to help you to find your dream home or to help you get rid of that old one. No matter if you're a first-time buyer or empty nester looking to downsize, she can help you with all your buying and selling needs. Check out Miss Dee Dee by visiting her website at www.imperialsouthco.com. No one is going to work harder to get you better results. See, I enjoy oral sex, but to be honest, some of my experiences have been not pleasing due to lack of proper vaginal hygiene. I went down on this chick once and the yoni was so good and fresh. It took me on like a whole nother level of just pleasure. So at that moment, I had to stop and ask, what are you using? And she told me, embrace Pangea Feminine Wash. We all know that a fresh yoni brings on a whole new level of confidence. So visit EmbracePangea.com. And of course, I got my winos covered for a discount. So use the coupon code Tasha K for 10% off your first order. Okay. I don't give a fuck to pay. You know what the fuck going on, bro. 
you're not gonna see here in front of your booth. Like she knows. And so, so what did what did Hazel I'm eat? Whoa. Go to the books because I genuinely loved him as a person. Okay. But I'm speaking my truth, and you left me while I was pregnant, and you didn't give a fuck. Okay. So that's why I'm bad, Tasha. I know. That's it. That's all bad. So <laughs> he knows my nigga. Like, uh, let's let's drop another clip. My nigga, don't don't be mad at me. Yeah, because I ain't give me I ain't give me y'all a full shit, but I'm gonna give y'all something. I'm not dumb. Like, don't do me like that. Okay. Don't do me like I'm lying. Bye. Yeah. Oh. Goodbye. Oh, he said he loved you. Let me see his face. Put the camera back up again with him saying that. I just want to make, you know, I just want everybody to, to see. Hold on. Okay, right there is good. Okay. Oh, so y'all were really deep in. So I don't want his wife to think like, oh, pound or this is like, I'm not her. Mm, okay. I'm not Selena Pound going around sucking it right now. Oh, <laughs> wow. Whore. Shout out to She's Selena. She gives us some She's great stories, though. Tired ass whore. Okay. We need bitches like Selena, though. She she gives us the wine. Like, Selena could do what she do, but. Yeah, I'm, Selena gives us the I'm wine. Gonna slap her, I'm going <laughs> to slap her when I see her. Why? For some other shit. What happened with you and Selena? Uh, the, now you know you'll break that little girl in half. I will fucking break that bitch. What happened with Selena? Oh, that's another story. You got to tell me real quick. Just real quick. Tasha. That girl hot. Now she talk a lot of shit from the internet. So when she sees somebody like, I'm going to beat the fuck out of you. Okay. Chrissy, I'm gonna beat the fuck out of her. Okay, no, no, no. We're not gonna issue threats on the uh, okay, plow. Right. I don't want you getting locked up. Beat the fuck out of you. Okay. Fuck okay. So she just too much. I don't like her. So what do you what do you want T Pain to know right now? Um that you strap motherhood away from me. Okay. You play with my life. How do you play with your life? I've never had a fucking disease in my life. It's a, it's a, it was a urinary tract infection. And women that's get them all the just, time, that's though. Disgusting. Okay. That's disgusting. Okay. Anything. Like, disease, why? Oh, pussy. Oh, gotta get fucking anything for your pussy is disgusting. Okay. My pussy supposed to be just like water. Because my I have good pussy. Okay. My shit's supposed to be like water. Oh, okay. Okay, so you strap motherhood away from me. You portrayed to be somebody you were for me. Okay. If I was gonna be a bust down, just like, oh, let's fuck. Goodbye. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Let me let me make that choice. Okay. Let me make that choice. Okay. But you didn't let me make that choice. Okay. I love you, babe. Are you cheating on me? Like, we, we ain't gonna go far. Okay. We ain't gonna go far to that. Oh, I don't want you messing up your makeup because I know you've been up, you know, you've been emotional. That, you, that shit fucked up. And I know it's a lot of, a lot of, a lot of more women going through this shit. Not just some fucking celebrities, right. just like, man, period. Like, man, playing games with you, man, lying. Man, leave but, you but, want. But let me like, ask you something. Like, but, but can I can I play like, can I play like can I play devil's advocate for a second? You know, I'm yes. not biased in this, okay? What if people were to say, I guess this is this is some sort of karma? Cause you knowingly slept with a married man. I'm just saying, That's like true. it's not my marriage, so I don't have That's a dog true. in this fight, you know? That's true. I had no business doing that. Okay. But you told me I had an open relationship. Okay, so he told you. So you were you were okay with being you planned on, a second. You planned, on, you planned on bringing me home to Amber. Oh, but you, love, but you fell in love with me. So wait a minute. Whoa, 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 whoa. 
you, you, he was going to take you home to his wife? Well, that's what he planned on it. At, like, take you home to meet her or take you home to fuck her? I guess meet her. I don't know. Because they had some little camera bitch that they that was standing in, standing in his house and that I had a fight with that she was just like so madly in love with him. And me and her is about to fight the hotel because she broke the glass. Like, it was just like too much. Okay. Tasha, like. Okay. <laughs> So you you were gonna sleep with his wife? Y'all were gonna be like in one relationship? I like pussy, I like pussy sometimes. Oh, okay. Okay. Yes. Like okay. I I loved him that much. And and why did you never go home? We never got to that point because I got pregnant. Okay. You know? Okay. So, um you know, you know how niggas is you get pregnant, they disappear, especially if they're like not all, like not all. No, not all men at all. Yeah, I mean, I've been. It's a lot of it's a lot of um, stand up men out here. Yeah, yeah. We can't we that can't go for all the we can't go for all the men. You know, it's just you know some. No, no, I will never. I'm not discrediting all. Men. I know, and I and I wholeheartedly believe one day you will find that right man for you. Okay. I'm gonna um, do some dating on the new show that I'm doing. What show? What what show? Wait a minute. What show? <laughs> We're gonna talk about it. Okay, you and Hazel, we got some up y'all sleeve. You know she stay with a damn show. You know we stay with some shit up our sleeve. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. Did you go to her wedding? Were you in her wedding? I did not go to her wedding. I was not in her wedding, and that shit broke my heart. Why? And I'm her best friend. Like, why didn't Why didn't she invite? Because you? at the time, Tasha, I was going through like a lot, you know, and um. I spoke to her that at her wedding. I'm like, I don't want to talk about that. Okay. Okay. I don't like I don't want to talk about that. Like Okay. Okay. It's like, yeah, like you're my best friend. Do you feel some type of way about it? Or, you know? But we're like gonna remake it all over again. Okay. Now a lot of people are coming for her husband saying that he's gay. Like he's why not. why do they say no, that? No, 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 no. Is he a cloud chaser? Nope. Okay. Well, I mean you're her friend. You I mean she you know she's nope, defending I him. Shout out to Davon every day. Okay. Okay. Oh. Shout out to Davon. I'm glad you yeah, spoke up for him. I, I never really got those vibes from him, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Fucking brother Davon, listen. Sometimes you just meet people you know, everybody has to elevate in life. Like, okay. You're not gonna fuck with somebody that doesn't have goals. Okay. They might, they may not have as more as much as you, but um, Devon is not that. Okay. I'm tired of people saying that Devon's gay because he's not. Yeah. People are bitter. People are sad. People are late. Okay. He's just a little handsome little motherfucker. Like, yeah, he is handsome. I give him that. He's a little she... handsome nigga. I call that nigga Drake. He got his hair cut down. So I'm like, Drake. Okay. Okay. But I'm happy. I don't think Jake, Drake's attractive, though. But, you know, Davon, uh, he looks uh, good. Uh, yes. Okay, like, he looks good. Okay. So, um, I'm happy for her. Okay. She's been through a lot. Okay. Like, Wait, a lot. Okay. Uh, I'm, happy. I'm happy she's in a great space and um, I feel like they're elevating together and you know sometimes a person doesn't always have to have more than you like as long as you're a solid motherfucker I fuck with you and that's just what we gonna do okay okay he's not a cloud chaser he's not gay just because he's a handsome individual it yeah. is what it is people are late and tired okay Man could be attracted to him. That's not his fault. He not getting his dick sucked. Yeah, I mean, okay. That's a word. You, you, you get what I'm saying? That's a word, yeah. Like, it's, like, bitches could be attracted to me. That doesn't necessarily mean I'm getting my pussy at Okay. You know? Yeah. And I'm bi- I'm bisexual. Okay, okay. <laughs> but, <laughs> okay. But, um, we're not doing that. Okay. Did you and T Pain have any threesomes or anything? Yes. You did? Well, who child? Who? Well, my homegirl. 
Oh, okay. Like, did y'all use protection? Please tell me y'all use protection. He used a kind of my hair. We never used it. Like oh, okay, okay, okay. All right, cool. Baby, I didn't think my coochie was edgy. Baby, girl. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so yeah, so y'all y'all had y'all. This was something y'all did on the regular. Oh, Christy, then I tell you to put that in the shower. I'm like, I'm not about to keep fucking you, and then my pussy is hot. Okay, get it together. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, listen. Thank you, thank you. Are you gonna send me that clip so I can add it in? I gotta add it in. That's what we doing? I gotta add it into the video. Hello. Just a two second clip. I'm ready for it, but I, can I say this? I'm ready for the drag. I'm ready for home record. This is not like nobody fucking had the relationship with him, but oh, okay. And to his wife. Oh, okay. And to his wife, to Pan Pan. Amber, like, I don't know if he knew about me or knew I was fucking him or knew I was pregnant or I would apologize to you as a woman. Cause I'm not that type of person, you know, that I got caught up in a fucking situation that I didn't know. Like, y'all know all these things she should know or if she, if she gonna be green, that's her problem. Yeah. But, um, I want to apologize to her. Okay. That I would never disrespect. Is it, is this a true apology or is this kind of a shady? I swear to God. Like, okay. I would never disrespect another woman's marriage. Okay. But you, were, but you were told y'all were you were going home to her. So I mean, I don't think you. That's what I'm saying. Like, oh, sometimes we get some pussy together. What? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you shut me up with that one. Like, okay, <laughs> okay, all right. I we should above coochies, but sorry. But um, but the baby no, fat jacket. Is, like, the baby fat jacket. Because I don't want to. I don't want her to feel like I'm dragging her husband. Uh, we did have. What we had, whatever. Okay. Would you take him um, back if he came back? That did good, uh, yeah. Okay. That dick is good. Okay. Okay. It makes me come really hard. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Make sure we put uh, only a pan pan involved. Pan pan. Oh, so the, you want the wife involved? I don't care. Like. Okay. That's what she want to do. Like, but okay. All right, well, listen. No, I truly, no, Tasha, I truly want to apologize to her for real. Okay. I'm sure she'll see this and he, I, don't, I don't know how she'll accept I, it. I don't see why she, and I don't want her, I don't want her shorty feelings because he, he, he had an outside baby on her already, he told me. Oh, okay. With who? I don't know the bitch. I'm trying to look for her myself. Oh, okay. <laughs> so I could have my baby, but she didn't have her baby, but. I tried to be down and loyal. Listen, that would have been a nice check for you had you would have kept that baby. I don't give a damn about no check. Shit, shit, I do. <laughs> I told him, let me get pregnant by a celebrity, see what happens. Even fucking with him, it wasn't about the money. I'm about like spirits and chemistry and shit like that. Like, I'm not a gold digger. Oh, so. That's not a gold digger. I mean, that's just making sure you and your kids are comfortable. But I don't want to be a single mother. You gonna be a single mom when you got money? I would be a single mother. Cause you get them kids the therapy. Wife. I'm just playing, girl. I'm just playing. I don't believe in having kids out of wedlock and stuff like that. I'm very traditional. I'm very old school. For me, hell no. Huh? He don't leave a pan pan for me. Like so, it's like I would have been a single mother. And I told him I was like, all right, fuck it. I'm just gonna get the abortion because like I'm be by myself with my kids. I'm scared of that. I'm scared of that. Okay. Well, listen. You know. You're going to find you a nice, wholesome man that's going to... Um, Where y'all at? Okay. No, <laughs> she said, call her now. She said, she's a freak. So call her. Um, so listen. No. I really want to thank you for giving Oh, no, thank you. You are hilarious, though. I'm not going to lie. This, this is... I didn't want to like... But your personality, you're just so bubbly. It's kind of hard not to smile sometimes, even though I know you're crying, but you are very hilarious. I love it. So I'm, I, I really want to, I really appreciate you for giving this platform to speak my piece. Anytime. So because this shit been bothering me for a long time. Okay. Okay. I really appreciate you. For okay. real. Thank you so much. Anytime. No, thank you. I appreciate you. Uh, you know, being without a legend reaction. 
Huh? That allergic reaction. Oh my God, do you hear me still like? <laughs> nah, bitch, I'm, st- I'm, st- <clears throat> I'm stuffed up. I couldn't breathe. That's how bad it was. I had to take an EpiPen and everything. Well, you so. look beautiful. Thank you. No, girl, I just threw myself the guy. I appreciate it, though. But thank you so much. Thank you, Passion. Where can everybody find you and ask you questions? Uh, at Pretty Passion Baby on Instagram. I really don't do, like, nothing else. Like, no OnlyFans. I don't suck people OnlyFans. I don't squat like Masika. Um... <laughs> I actually paint my red hair. This is my crib. Okay. You never see me squatting. So I um, follow me on Instagram at Pretty Passion Baby. And thank you, Tasha K, so much. Like, I know I've been crying out to you. It's okay. It's okay. Because this shit was so hard for me. Like, because I don't want this nigga to feel like I'm throwing him under the bus. Like, nigga, but I got to see my shoes. Okay. Okay. Yeah. All right. No, you're good. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate you. And listen, um, I just need that two second clip to Which add one? in. What part? The one when he told you he loved you. Because he does love me. And I love him too. <laughs> True. <laughs> oh, chow, chow, chow. And Pam Pam going to love me too when she get her shit together. Uh, is this a solicitation? Bye, Pam Pam. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Passion. I'm going to hang up here and I'm going to call you on your regular phone, okay? Okay, love you. All right, thank you. Bye. Welcome to Hollywood, y'all. Okay, listen, listen. I told y'all. Uh-uh, because I'm back on OBS, so yes. Um... Okay, guys, that is the end. If you guys have questions for Passion, you can find her at what? Passion Pretty Baby on Instagram, okay? She'll be taking uh, DMs and everything like that. Like I said, I apologize. I cannot perform tonight, okay? But we will be back next week, okay, with some hella fire content, okay? I hope you guys had a good time, all right? And now we got to go. All right, and before I go, hello, bye. I've been told that finding your perfect match is almost impossible, almost. Well, guess what, baby? No more swiping left, because whether you want something big, something small, something new, or you just feel like dumping your old one. Miss Didi of Imperial South Co. is a licensed Georgia real estate agent who is here to help you to find your dream home or to help you get rid of that old one. No matter if you're a first time buyer or empty nester looking to downsize, she can help you with all your buying and selling needs. Check out Miss Didi by visiting her website at www.imperialsouthco.com. No one is gonna work harder to get you better results. See, I enjoy oral sex, but to be honest, some of my experiences have been not pleasing due to lack of proper vaginal hygiene. I went down on this chick once and the yoni was so good and fresh. It took me on like a whole nother level of just pleasure. So at that moment, I had to stop and ask, what are you using? And she told me, embrace Pangea Feminine Wash. We all know that a fresh yoni brings on a whole new level of confidence. So visit EmbracePangea.com. And of course, I got my winos covered for a discount. So use the coupon code Tasha K for 10% off your first order. AdamandEve.com. I'm talking toys, bondage, lingerie, and so much more. Plus, they have 24-7 customer service. So you can order at 3 a.m. if you ain't coming, if you get me, okay? And if something isn't working out, you can send it back within 90 days. No hassle. And if that's not enough, you can also take pleasure in knowing that 20% of their profits goes to help fight the spread of HIV around the world. So go on ahead and log on to adamandeve.com. Use the code Tasha K for 50% off one item plus free shipping in the U.S. and Canada. Some exclusions apply now, but hurry up and visit adamandeve.com so they can make you come. The Olive Leaf 
perfect strike can reverse high blood pressure and diabetic high blood sugar, or the sugar, as some of our grandmamas may call it. It can also kill any nasty little bugs in your bodies like parasites, bacteria, fungi, tumors, and much, much more. And if that's not enough, you can also tell certain cancers like breast, prostate, colon, liver, and skin cancer to take a seat because the olive leaf extract has been known to fight it. And their friend lupus can get it too. So visit myoliveleaf.biz to help get your health in order.